Alrighty guys, so here is everything I got. It's not a terribly too big haul, but it's pretty much some, some stuff that I just needed to go ahead and get by with um, for like sides and stuff and some stuff I just wanted to try. So we're going to go ahead and get started. So I'm going to start over here. Um, I did go ahead and get some more brown eggs. I was going to go to Costco and just get the 18 count, but really we, ha we still have some brown eggs in our um, fridge, so I honestly didn't need a ton. Plus, I really do like this brand of eggs. I like the vital farms are just there's something about the way they cook um it's easier to cook and they don't stick to the pan too much and also just the fact that it's healthier for you um so that's why i wanted to go ahead and get these ones so i did go ahead and grab an 18 count it is kind of expensive at sprouts i think these were about for this one was nine dollars um but if you were like to go to walmart which i don't think walmart actually has an 18 count but this one if you go at sprouts is about nine dollars and then over here, I did go ahead and get some produce um, or more kind of like salads. So I did go ahead and get these over here. So um, I wanted to go ahead and get these beets. I really do like beets, to be honest. I love it in my salad. It's so good, um, especially with this flavor. So organic mild, mild vinegar. It does not be organic, but anything with the mild vinegar is really good. Um, so I'm gonna really excited because I actually really like beets. And it was on sale for two for seven at Sprout. So I got two. So I got one that was white wine and balsamic. And then this one was the organic mild vinegar. So I got two of those. I saw this and I thought it was really interesting. I do like sriracha. Um, I do like spice, as you guys know, for many of my hauls. Me and Cody love spice. So I did go ahead and get these Josie Organics, which I actually never tried this brand. But I was very interested in the fact that it's a sriracha one. So um, I don't know if I'm going to have it right now. I'm going to have something right now. But <laughs> I did want to go ahead and try this one. And it looks like this one is green cabbage, romaine, um, and then it looks like it's sriracha ranch dressing. So I don't know if I'm going to wait for Cody. He doesn't usually eat salads. So I might just eat it right now. And then I did go ahead and get baby spinach. I just, I like baby spinach in my eggs. Um, as you guys know, I love egg, I like egg, spinach with eggs. Um, so I grabbed this and I also might just get to make it in a salad too. But um, I grabbed some baby spinach and then I did go ahead and grab arugula. Arugula is really hard to find in the grocery stores, by the way. So if you ever are looking for arugula, sprouts is a way to go for arugula if you guys are in the hunt for it. Because I've been to so many of these grocery stores stores for Instacart and they never have arugula so went to Sprouts grabbed arugula and I just figured it'd be really good for like um a salad so these two together and those beets oh my god it's good I, I know it's gonna be good so I grabbed these two I did need some romaine hearts because you guys know I love making tuna salad and I like making it with I like eating it with romaine boats um, it's just really good and it's a lot it's carbless so that's why it's very good if you have it with a lettuce wrap so I just grabbed that and that way I can go ahead and eat my tuna salad with no problem like I said guys I needed fruit fruit is just Kaysen likes fruit I like fruit um, these the berries are just a lot better for me and Kaysen to really use I thought I grabbed strawberries, but I guess I didn't. I forgot to grab strawberries, and I only grabbed the berries. So, oh well. Um, but anyways, I grabbed some raspberries. Kaysen finally really likes raspberries. Um, he used to. He doesn't really like love it, but it's something that he can tolerate. Um, if, if I just cut him up one, and I like having it in my yogurt, so that's why I grabbed me one. And grab some blackberries. I haven't fed case in blackberries. I think blackberries are a little bit sour. So mainly the blackberries are for me. But I'm going to try to give it to him and see if he likes it. But I just grabbed these. And then these blueberries are a lot bigger than the regular blueberries I got. So that's why I really am impressed with Sprouts fruits. Because Sprouts just, I don't know. Sprouts just has more fresh fruits, like I said. So I grabbed these ones and... They're pretty damn big, so I'm really excited about this one. Kaysen absolutely freaking loves blueberries, so this is going to last us quite a while. Um, or it might not even quite a while. It's going to last us between the two of us. It's probably going to last us like a week, so I got some blueberries for Kaysen. I did go ahead and get these Wild Wonders tomato. I like tomato on my salmon salads and also just... I don't, I don't like it just as a snack, but on my eggs too, I really like some of 
those tomatoes. Um, I did go ahead and get some avocados at Sprouts. It's like 79 cents. So I did go ahead and grab four of them. I love avocado. Um, and then I'll actually start over here. And then I did go ahead and get some frozen stuff. So these were on sale for two for five two for five. I think they're two for five or two for seven, but these are pretty expensive. I'm not gonna lie. I think these ones were like five dollars um, or four. I don't know. I, I don't have my receipt guys, <laughs> but basically I got it for a sale for two for something and I got some of this is quinoa and kale. It just looked really interesting. This looks like something I could just easily eat um, and then also I got this one which is uh, Southwest Mango Quinoa Blend. I really like quinoa, so honestly, I think it's going to be really good for just like an easy meal that I can just eat. So I grabbed two of them. So again, this was quinoa kale, and this one's a Southwest Mango Quinoa Blend. Um, so I'm really excited to really try it. I don't think you really need to add anything on it. I mean, you can, but it just looks like you can just eat it on its own. So I'll let you guys know how I feel about that one. And then you guys know, again, how I feel about the Alexia brand. Alexia brand is just, it's really good. I really like that brand. And um, these ones are really freaking good. These Yukon you can Select Garlic Fries. I can only find them at Sprouts. I can never find them at any other grocery stores. So that's why when I went to Sprouts, this was like definitely something I had to grab because I never could find them at any of my other grocery stores. And then every time I did Instacart, someone ordered this and it just, it looked interesting to me. So I wanted to try it. So I only grabbed one, but it's these Alexia loaded cauliflower with white cheddar and uncured bacon. Um, it just looks really good. It looks like something easy to make. Um, I probably could make it myself, but honestly, I just wanted to try it and see what it tastes like. So I don't know when I'm going to have this, but I just decided to grab it. And then over here... I have this in the frozen section, but whatever. I have some dark chocolate covered pretzels. I just needed something for my sweet tooth sometimes. Like sometimes I just want to snack on chocolate. And I really like this. I like the Sprouts chocolate covered chocolate, whatever. It's just, they're really good. They're kind of pricey, but still really good. And then in this, I did go ahead and get the spinach feta chicken sausage. I've heard really great things about the sausage from Sprouts. They're, I guess it's just super good to really mix with. I don't know what I'm going to eat it with. I could just do like chicken and rice, but I've never really cooked this type of sausage. So um, I'm going to see what I make it with. I'm probably going to make it with some kind of rice, but maybe it'll be really good with that quinoa and kale maybe but yeah so i grabbed these two i grabbed like a pound of it so um i think i only paid let's see 489 for it so i really wanted to try it every time i go on instacart shopping everybody's ordered it so it was my turn to try it and then over here i did go ahead and get some bread Kaysen's really into bread so that's why i grabbed it and it had mickey mouse so i just obviously needed to give it to him i had to get it for him because it's mickey mouse so um i don't think it has mickey mouse on it but on the on the bag it does so i did go ahead and grab this for Kaysen. and then i was super excited when i saw this at sprouts because i if you guys don't know me and you guys are new here I'm a very big beer fan. I know this is coffee, but I am, me and my fiance Cody are super big beer, super big into beer. Um, so Modern Times is a really good beer company, but they also make coffee. So when I went to Sprouts and saw that they had the coffee, I've had it before and they're really good coffee. So I'm super excited to really try this. So I grabbed two of them. I was going to grab four, but I didn't want to go overboard because it was expensive. It was $4.99. So I grabbed two of them. I'm really excited about this one. And then getting into the end of this, guys, I did go ahead and get some mushrooms again. I just needed it for my eggs. Um, usually, I just really like having mushrooms in my eggs and also in my salads. I just absolutely love mushrooms in my salads. So that's why I grabbed some mushrooms. And then this one's more for Cody, but I really like eating these too because these are really good, but they're really bad for you because I'm a diabetic. Or if you are a diabetic, these are, corn is terrible for you. So I grabbed it as just like a little treat for me and more for Cody, but it's a corn toasted chipotle lime flavor. These are so good to snack on. Like I said, really dangerous, really bad for you if you're a diabetic, but they are a really good treat. Um, Sprouts has really good trail mix too. So that's why I only grabbed the corn for now, just because that's really all I wanted. Um, 
And lastly, these two right here. I've seen these in the Instacart. Not when I've been Instacart shopping for other people, but for my own <laughs> Instacart shopping. I've seen these and I keep having it in my cart, but I just haven't tried it. So I really like Chia's, to be honest. I like the texture of it. It's really weird, but <laughs> I wanted to try it because it looks really good and it looks really good for you. So I just grabbed two of them. I got, usually would want to get more, but I just grabbed two for now to see how I feel about it. So I did get the green magic. I don't know what the green magic is. Let's see here. Uh, I'm not sure what the flavors are on this guy. Sorry, but I think it's just like basically green like green machine if you guys know what that is So I grabbed that and then I got the strawberry banana one. So I'm really excited to try that. I'll probably try it soon here But here is everything I got from sprouts. Um, again I'm probably gonna go grocery shopping or another place eventually, but I just for now This is gonna do me justice and I just as you guys know, we're trying to go more organic here and a little bit more healthier. So that's why I went to All right, guys. So here is my Costco haul. Um, the only two things that I'm not going to show you today is going to be the dog food and the cat litter. They're just really heavy. So I didn't bring it into the house, actually. So I'm waiting for Cody to actually bring it into the house because I just can't carry it on my own um, without bring my back so that's the only two things that i didn't get but to kind of tell you the price the dog food was 27.99 and the cat litter was 9.69 nothing too exciting but here is everything that i got and we're gonna go ahead and get started so just starting the main reason why i needed to go to costco was because we needed tissue paper um obviously tissue paper is a necessity right now but it seems like everybody is pretty at least all the grocery stores are starting to get really stocked again. So I ended up buying some toilet paper because we finally finished the last few rolls in our home. So um, I bought a new one. And then getting into the actual food. So starting with this big thing right here. I've seen so many people <laughs> talk about this and seen so many people grab this. And especially on Costco Does Again or Costco Deals on Instagram. They just, I've always seen so many people talk about this. So I decided to grab it myself so it's the con i think it's called tonkatsu um ramen and i really enjoy ramen i'm not gonna lie it's not the greatest for me because of the noodles but i really do enjoy my little asian in me and have some actual really good noodles in my life so i just decided to grab this one i think this one comes with six bowls so um this is gonna go in my stock up pantry which at the end of this video i'm gonna kind of briefly show you guys my stock up pantry um just so that i can actually show you guys what i actually use my stuff for so um i bought this and i'm really excited because i think i'm gonna try it either for lunch day but i did eat so i'm not probably gonna try it <laughs> Anyways, back into the actual haul. So starting right here, I did go ahead and get this killer salsa. Um, I've seen people have this before. I never tried it myself, but we have some tortilla chips that we need to use up. So I grabbed some killer salsa since we don't have any. This one looks like, I don't know exactly what makes it so great, but we're going to try it out and I'll let you guys know how I feel about it. Or if you guys have tried it out, please let me know in the comments how good it is. So I grabbed that. I also grabbed some spinach artichoke and parmesan. This past weekend when I was in California, my cousin actually made us some with like, she heated it up and then she put crackers in it. So not crackers in it but ate it with crackers and it was actually really good so i'm gonna do that myself now i'm gonna actually heat this up and then eat it as a snack and dip um just because i felt really it was just delicious so um i grabbed a big container of that i grabbed some strawberries because as you guys know earlier from my sprouts haul i didn't grab strawberries so i grabbed some strawberries for Kason and i um hopefully i finish this all typically i'm trying to be really good about eating at home now so um i bought a big container of strawberries from costco and then with my spinach and artichoke dip i did go ahead and get this organic mary's gone cracker super seed everything um i just figured that i get something that's a little bit healthy and also just the fact that it has all the seeds in it that i need and uh, to really get me all those nutrients that i need so i just grab this crackers and i'm gonna eat it with my spinach and artichoke dip and then i'll start right here i got some bananas 
nothing special. We just, we needed bananas. We were gone for a week and our bananas went bad. So <laughs> I got some bananas. And then I did go ahead and get these su sukis. I think that was called, but I don't know. But anyways, it's chicken coconut curry with mango. It sounded really good. It comes with two pouches. So I figured this would probably be a really easy dinner for us one night because we really like curry. Uh, me and Cody just really enjoy it. So I grabbed a container of this. This one's on sale, actually. I think it's for $10.99 right now, and typically it's $14. So I grabbed that. And then also for easy dinners or easy thing for Cody to grab, I grabbed this Angus cheeseburgers. It comes with eight indiv individually wrapped. So he can just grab that from the freezer if he's hungry and I don't feel like cooking or if he needs something for lunch. So I grabbed that. And then I did get some sour cream. I got the pouches. I was going to get the big container, but honestly, I just figured that it'd be easier just to get the squeezed pouches. Um, typically, we just eat it a lot with like nachos. Um, sometimes we have it in our soups like chili so that's why I grabbed this and it'd probably just be easy to use instead of getting a spoon every time so I grabbed a good container of that and then I did go ahead and get bacon we finally were low on bacon so I grabbed the Kirkland thick slice one I really enjoy this I don't know if Cody really does because I think it's more fattier for him but honestly this lasts us a while so hopefully he can just deal with it so grab that typically i always get turkey bacon too so i don't know i just grab that and then this can be like for me and casein but i bought this mainly for casein for lunches and um, just because i like to feed it to him and with cheese so i did go ahead and get him the hellshire farms it was either this or the kirkland one but this one was a little cheaper at nine dollars and 69 cents um and it comes with a shit ton so <laughs> i decided to get that and then you guys know at Costco, I always get the Caesar salad one, but this time I decided I'm just going to get this a different one this time. So I got the Asian cashew chop salad. Um, I actually really like this one. Uh, the dressing's not terribly the greatest, but it's still a really good salad, something I do recommend as well. But if there's another salad I do recommend from Costco, it's always that Caesar salad, as you guys know. And then this is new that I bought. Again, I'm in a noodle kick. It's really not the greatest for me. Noodles are not good for you if you're a diabetic, but I like having noodles and I'm 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 just Asian and it it's something that I crave most of the time now. So I do go ahead, I did grab this teriyaki stir fry undone um, with mixed vegetables. It looks like you just microwave it and it's good in minutes. So I figured this would be something easy if you're hungry or if I'm hungry and I want something. So I just grabbed this because I figured it'd be easy to just make. And then lastly, again, for casein, but Cody's probably going to eat it too. So <laughs> I did go ahead and get these Dino Buddies. Um, casein does like having chicken nuggets. Um, it's also an easy dinner for us to just put together so for him. So I just grabbed that for him. And then some nights Cody just likes having chicken nuggets with fries so he probably will grab some of that too so yeah so that is everything that i got from costco Alrighty, everybody so that is everything for my grocery haul i hope you guys ended up liking it i know it's different than smith's and my costco haul but i didn't buy too much from costco because you guys saw that i did a costco not that long ago um but this is just gonna hold us off for quite a while and also just the fact that i bought some stuff and sprouts anyway so yeah so i hope you guys ended up liking this video if you guys are into grocery hauls and you guys are new here i hope this video was enough for you to subscribe if not it's totally okay i do understand not my channel is not for everybody but if you guys did like this video please feel free to like comment and subscribe um Champ is outside, as you guys know, so that's why I've been trying to help out with that, um, with the noise. So, yeah. But anyways, for everybody else, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll see you guys in my next one, whatever it happens to be. I do have quite a few different videos that I need to edit, actually, and put out there. Um, but yeah. So, have a great day, guys. I will see you in my next one.